Hello, I'm Renee Esquivel, and you're tuned into my YouTube channel, Technologist on the Go. Now, with the recent release of Ventura 13.3 and iOS 16.4, uh, I don't see anywhere in the documentation about it doing anything for continuity camera, but somebody did something. Because now, on my Mac Mini M1, a 2020 model, I'm able to use my iPhone 13 Pro as a wireless webcam without having to attach another external webcam, which was stupid to me, and I know it was stupid to a lot of people, that that was the case. Um, it was not a big deal on the uh, laptops, MacBook Air, MacBook Pro, it uh, wasn't a big deal because they had built-in webcams and so continuity camera would just work. Um, but now with uh, this latest update, uh, you can do the same now. You can use your iPhone as a wireless webcam in the way that you all believed it would have worked from the outset, which is simply uh, putting it at a dark uh, lock screen, bringing it in close to your Mac Mini M1 or M2, and all of a sudden you hear that wonderful little chime and it's now working as a webcam. Okay, let's get right into this and let you see this in action, okay? And there are some caveats, but I'll address those at the end. Looky, looky. Okay, you have the iPhone, this iPhone 13 Pro. And here is my Mac Mini M1 2021 model. And uh, as you can see, it's running Ventura version 13.3. As far as the iPhone goes, uh, let's see here. It's running iOS 16.4. They all got updated. You can see that that's at the dark login screen. And let me go um, open up FaceTime. Go to video and lo and behold, <laughs> the iPhone is there. Look at that. Look at that. And I don't, as you can tell by looking at the video here and uh, microphones, I do have stuff here, but you no longer see me having another, having to connect a, uh, a webcam. I don't have to do that anymore. It seems like they fixed that. You'd think they should have done that from the start, but they did it. They made it so now you can use your iPhone as a wireless webcam, whether or not your target Mac system has a built-in webcam. Oh, joy. Okay, one additional test I want to do uh, on the iPhone is that's using it as a wired webcam as opposed to wireless. So for that, let me... Um, Use Spotlight to quickly bring up FaceTime. Okay. And now I'm going to plug in my iPhone. And there you see immediately it came right up. Okay. I just wanted to see that was working because um, I don't see anywhere in Apple's documentation they made announced any changes to continuity camera, but they did make a change. A change has appeared. And that change is, it works in wireless mode. Uh, you see the, uh, let me get disconnected. Go to dark, come here to video again, and uh, I recorded it, I captured it, I had it. Okay, so I'm gonna check all the settings. I wanna make sure that everything 
is the way it was when I first had the wireless continuity camera working on my Mac Mini M1 without attaching another webcam. And uh, so I'm going to go to Universal Control, which is not continuity camera. I just want to make sure that I am not attached to my iPad. And uh, so I want to make sure that nothing's interfering. And uh, there's no specific continuity camera feature enabled on, uh, that I have to enable here. So let me go to FaceTime now. And you can see the iPhone is uh, at a dark lock screen. Now I come here and I don't see it. Wow. I don't see it. But I recorded it. You saw it earlier. Let me go to the iPhone itself. Continuity camera. Right there. I'll bounce that setting. Now I'll come back and I'll go to offline dark screen. Come into FaceTime. And I still don't see the uh, iPhone being added to FaceTime. Let me restart FaceTime. There we go. There we go. You see it. You see it again. It's working in... Uh, let me set the uh, use it microphone, but it kicked in automatically. And this is wireless mode. And I'm going to use my, uh, you don't see, uh, this is just a uh, lightning cable that I didn't have connected to anything else. You can see that that's disconnected. And the video feed you're seeing uh, displayed uh, there is coming from the iPhone and so apparently uh, Apple has done something that's a step in the right direction to fixing the continuity camera I should add though that I don't see the I haven't been able to make it work as a wireless webcam on my MacBook Pro only as a wired now, and I used to be able to do it either way. But if I had to choose between which one, I I, I prefer, I really want both to be honest, but if I have to choose Mac Mini M1, getting a wireless iPhone webcam without having to attach Another webcam is by far the the more useful option and the more intuitive one. Because um, frankly, it was stupid to have to connect another webcam just to use the iPhone. Um, not a documented change, but you see it here. So there, <laughs> technologist on the go. Okay, you see it there. Now, one of the caveats is, as you saw me... Uh, uh, illustrate is after connecting the iPhone in wired mode as a webcam, I had to bounce the continuity camera setting on the iPhone before it would work again as a wireless webcam. And maybe it would have taken effect uh, on its own and, and it just needed more time, but you saw how I did it there. And the other one is, and I had footage to display this, but for the interest of time, I, I just cut this uh, short. On my 2019 MacBook Pro, which is an Intel system, I could not, and emphasize N-O-T, could not get the iPhone to work as a wireless webcam, and I had been able to do that before. It does work as a wired webcam using a lightning cable, but not in wireless mode, and I, I fought that. 
Um, I'm interested in seeing if anybody who has a silicone laptop, if they encounter a similar issue there, that the iPhone only works as a webcam uh, continuity camera when it's wired as opposed to being able to work wirelessly. But aside from that, please have at it. Give me your likes and comments, and I will certainly uh, try to replicate any issue that you might describe here to get you answers. And, uh, and if you have your own channel, you know I'm going to subscribe to your channel, watch content, and leave likes so that we help each other out at the same time. Thank you very much and goodbye.